Can we talk about Henry Kissinger? Oh, God. Henry Kissinger, when he died, I, I was like probably five days. I was not functional. I, I would, it would, that one man, and he lived a hundred, probably drinking blood, human blood. Henry Kissinger was very involved with Sue and I when we were little kids. He was very, very involved with Sue until she wrote Thanks for the Memories. And after she wrote Thanks for the Memories, after she wrote Thanks for the Memories, um, Henry Kissinger fired her. And he said, I've had it with you. And very terrible things happened to her daughter because of thanks for the memories and he fired her and he hooked her up with some very famous religious person who she began to be taken to the global satanic rituals with this high level religious figure and was there with him uh, bringing in a new world order and all the world leaders would show up and uh, there would be huge satanic rituals. Oh, Kissinger is, Kissinger still, I don't know why. And I actually, the Holy Spirit, when he died, took me through your book and took me to a very specific high level, like Abaddon. And I can't remember the exact demons, but they were the ones that were connecting me still to Henry Kissinger. And so I had major deliverance and major revelation that that your book helped me, books, I have to use all three of them, helped me to help God to lead me through to what I needed to do to get free of Henry Kissinger. It was huge. And that guy is a kingpin. And, you know, people text or emailed Sue and, you know, because they don't know I'm not her. And said, you know, gosh, Henry, did you know Henry Kissinger died or, you know, just whatever they said. And every time someone died, a president or like when when Reagan died and when Bush died, when they all the presidents died or anybody, that's when Sue, Sue would become dysfunctional. And I got to experience what that felt like. It's just you just you can't function. But a lot of people you know, we're, we're saying that to Sue on these emails, aren't you relieved that he's gone? <laughs> he's probably left a, an army. I mean, he's written about the New World Order. He wrote all openly about all this stuff a long time ago. And people just, I don't know, I get people just can't even seem to fathom the fact that the New World Order is real.